supposed to be? It's a spy gadget. I took it from an unmanned sub. Yeah, what sort of spy gadget? The newest. <laughs> Whatever. Huh? Get rid of it! What? Why? Does it look new with all that shunky wiring? Oh, that's uh, our wiring. Look at that! Transponder signals from every vessel within a hundred miles. So what? There. That's a World Ocean Authority sub, 12 miles away. Now we can avoid it. Still think it's useless? Aye, I, I do! That one's an EPIRB. Is that some other useless thing? They're vital. It's an emergency distress beacon. All boats have them. They activate on contact with water, so that vessel is in major trouble. Whoa, it's a Necton sub, but not the Aranax. Fontaine's grandparents. The Nectons have been looking for them. Uh, they're sinking? <laughs> Maybe this guy just worth having after all. Fontaine. My family are explorers. We have been for generations. While others look up to the stars, we know there are an infinite number of things that shine in the darkness below. There are things lurking in the seas that long ago vanished into myth. My family are the Nectons, and we explore the deep. Sleeping sperm whales never gets old. Can you sleep like that, Jeff? Nice! <gasps> Fontaine, newsflash! I got a signal from your grandparents' sub! What face is that? Happy? Oh, I get it. You got company. Why didn't you just say so? I gotta say, I miss your usual snappy comebacks. Anyway, I lost the signal before I could get the coordinates, but it was definitely your grandparents' sub. <gasps> Incredible. Wow. That's cool. Uh... Sorry, I thought you'd be happy. Mm-hmm. Okay, I tried. Later. Tape can fix anything. <laughs> Great work, Danny boy. Ah, there's those coordinates. Ye are a sinking Necton sub, ripe to plunder. Oh, this gadget is the future. Not if the authorities use it to track us. Didn't think of that, did you, Finn? The authorities don't even know we've got it. Are you? Gonna tell him? Duh. Now let's find that stuff! Jenny <laughs> boy! Uh, not enough tape. If the whales are really asleep, well, why don't they sink? We covered this in homeschool. Don't you remember? Finn, what are you up to? So nice to hear your voice. <sighs> Here are your grandparents' coordinates. Thank me any time. How do I know you're telling the truth? Would I lie to you? You are a pirate. Fontaine, I'm not just a... Hi! Hmm. Talking to your girlfriend again? She is not my girlfriend. Then why are you giving her secret information? Is it a secret? Really? Would you tell Dad you told her? What? No! It's a secret. Fontaine deserves to know where her grandparents are. She's a Necton! She deserves scurvy! Come on. Wouldn't you be worried if I went missing? Don't answer that. Just don't tell Dad, please. Well, we'll just have to see if I can keep a secret better than you. <sighs> I have to tell you something. What is it, Fontaine? Finn called. He picked up an EPIRB signal from Gran and Grant's sub, off the coast of Brazil. What? I know, I know. 
pirate, but he has no reason to lie to me. How could Hammerhead Sub pick up a signal when nobody else has? All the rescue services would know by now if there was an EPIRB distress signal. But what if Finn's telling the truth, and they're out there needing help? It's about ten times more likely to be a sick prank. Right, Jeffrey? Professor Fiction. Indeed it is. Hello, Neptunes. I have remarkable news. Better than remarkable. Unprecedented news. My hollow earth theory is correct and the lizard people have made contact? Incorrect. Will, a satellite has picked up an EPIRB signal, a very weak one, from your parent's sub. I knew he wasn't lying. But when? Where? Just now. Apparently, they're off the coast of Brazil, about 100 nautical miles from you. This makes no sense. Our last clue came from the Indian Ocean. And the one before that was in the South Atlantic. If my parents have been traveling so far, why wouldn't they be in contact? I don't know, Dad, but we need to go to that location, don't we? Yes! Yes. See? Finn isn't so bad after all. We've just passed Laje de Santos. Then you're almost at the coordinates. Slowing to three knots. I've just lost the signal. Can you see anything? Not so far. Professor Fiction gave us the exact coordinates Finn gave me. It's gotta be here somewhere. Unless maybe Finn tricked the professor too? No, he wouldn't. Wow, what a surprise, the Dark Orca. Once a pirate, always a pirate. <laughs> Greetings, Nakans! I'm sorry, Fontaine, but I think Finn's played us, and you, again. Hammerhead, what are you doing here? Oh, just a bit of fishing. What are you doing here? Don't play games with me. What do you know about my parents? Well, I'm guessing they're relatives of yours. Oh, sorry. I, I think I've got a bite. Bye! Well, Finn, I don't see an old folk submarine, do you? Um... Guess your fancy machine's not working. What are they playing at? <sighs> you better answer, Finn. So, what do we know about those missing nectars? Nothing, just that they've been missing a long time. Activating stealth mode. Hmm. Those nectons are sounding edgy. I like that. Those grandparents must be worth a fortune. Or maybe they just care about their family? <laughs> no one cares that much. I've noticed. Madeline, what do you know about the old Nectons? I'm not as close to the Nectons as Finn. I know nothing at all. And maybe that gadget knows even less. And maybe it knows more. Listen, we're gonna find those old Nectons and milk them for every penny. Great idea, Dad. Right, Finn? There's the signal again. Looks like it's moved a long way from here. Follow it, Danny boy! Aranax? I'm outside the Dark Orca. What? It's okay. They haven't seen me. Listen, they've got some high-tech gadget. I can see Granogram's IDs on the screen. Finn definitely knows more than he's letting on about their location. Fontaine, come back. If they see you... They won't. I'm in stealth mode. Stealth mode? You took my night? What can I say? It was for a good cause. I question that. We're on our way. Just stay exactly where- I can't let this go. I'm going in. Fontaine, wait! Fontaine! See? There's just no reasoning with her. That's Fontaine's wrist tracker signal. So we know where to find her. And I do trust her to make good decisions. Seriously? Taking my knight is not a good decision. We'll tail them at a distance. You pilot, Will. I'll direct.
Fontaine? Aunt, quiet. Taking my knife? Boarding the Dark Orca? So, it's exactly the kind of thing you normally do. But th that's me. I'm, uh, creative. Listen, Finn has Gran and Graham's coordinates on this gadget. I want that information. <laughs> Fontaine? Fontaine, are you there? Well, well, well. What do we have here? A juicy little Nectin. Madeline? You have traps set up on your own sub? We have a rodent problem. This is a very big trap. You're a very big rodent. So, why are you trespassing? Why have you got pictures of my grandparents on that fancy gadget? That's why you're here? It's not to, I don't know, visit Finn? Why would I want to do that? Maybe because he's your boyfriend? He is not my boyfriend. That'll disappoint him. He obviously likes you. He does? Yes, it's time to let you down. Well, two different satellites have picked up the signal again. The thing is, now the signal's moving. Here are the coordinates. What? That's where we're heading right now. And the Dark Orca, too. Do you think this is a setup by Hammerhead? Could they have already sent Gran and Grab sub? They are capable. I'm putting a stop to them right now. Dad, no! You can't ram them! Uh, Dad? Mom? Will? Fontaine's on board. You didn't really think I'd ram them, did you? Never doubted you. Shh. Hammerhead, you and I need to chat. Did he say chat? Players don't chat. Did he just mute me? We know you have high-tech spyware on board. Shishu! Well, Ant's gone too, and so is the White Knight. <sighs> he muted me? Nobody mutes me! Hammerhead, if you know where my parents are... You know, I think I do. And I'll be demanding a big, fat ransom! <clears throat> where are you taking me? Oh, are you still hoping to see your boyfriend? Stop it. You're being ridiculous. Am I? Well, I'll take you to my dad then. Or is that what you want? Why would I want to be taken to Hammerhead? Maybe so you can get closer to our fancy gadget. That's how a pirate would think. <laughs> As if you'd know how a pirate thinks. Fine. Don't take me to your father. You'd like that, wouldn't you? Hm. You're the pirate. You tell me. Ugh, my head hurts. Okay, Hammerhead. I'm willing to pay you for information about my parents. That sounds like wages. I don't work for you. I'm self-employed. I'll decide what I want, and I want ransom. That's still money. I suppose we could barter. <sighs> what did you have in mind? Oh, I don't know. I give you information about your parents, and you give me information about, oh, say, uh, Lemuria? Lemuria? But it's just a legend. Oh, is it now? Where are you, Fontaine? Ugh. Aunt Necton? What are you doing here? What have you done with my sister? Fontaine's here? Uh, maybe. Maybe not. You know, for some weird reason, she seems to trust you. Uh, she does? Yeah, but I don't. Huh. Fair enough. Did you pirates have anything to do with my grandparents' disappearance? Whoa, what? No way. 
We just picked up a signal from their sub with some new technology we acquired. Stole, you mean. With style. Were we here before? The dirt looks familiar. Eh, it's dirty everywhere. We're pirates. Duh. Give me a real challenge. Dark Orca, heave to and remain stationary. You're under arrest for spyware theft. Oh, no, we aren't. Hit it! Dark Orca, stay where you are. Stop immediately. They're running. With Anton Fontaine still on board. What the? Aranax, stop your engines immediately. Can't do that. Deploy the defenses! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Watch out! Ah. The Nectons are ink bombing me? Keep pursuing them. Commander Parasol, that wasn't us. Whoa. <laughs> what on earth? Commander, I say again. Ah! Move over. I'll deal with these soaps once and for all. Death, no! Now that wasn't me. Attention all Dark Orca and Aranax crew members. You are all under arrest. All? We'll never surrender! I told you they'd find us! Here's an idea. Ant Necton, trespassing on my ship. Funny story, Finn captured me. Quite cleverly, actually. <laughs> it, it was nothing. So here's what I'm thinking. You swapped a prisoner, that's me, and your stolen spy gadget for your freedom. Hmm. Never! Yeah, Necton, never! Seriously? Who wouldn't go for that deal? Me! Okay. Um, uh, gotta run! Yeah! Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you scurvy dogs will pay for that! Talk to your daughter. It's her trap. Nice. It was, wasn't it? You really want to start this thing up again? Now, and hurry! Yes! Okay, Danny, follow me and bring that. Remain stationary. Officers of the World Ocean's Authority will board your craft. Hammerhead's jettisoned something. The spy gadget, I bet. Doesn't want to get caught red-handed. I said stay where you are. <laughs> yeah! Nectons, I would strongly advise you not to move. I have questions. Commander, we're on the same side. We were trying to recover that stolen technology. You want it back, right? Very much so. Well, it's sinking fast. And so far, your people can't even catch the world's worst submarine. Do you really trust them to find something that small? I am satisfied with your statement. I will retrieve it myself. Drive carefully. Jeffrey! Can you two please communicate first if you intend to board a pirate ship? Sorry, Sorry Mom. Mom. Hello, Nectons. And Fontaine. Sorry I missed you earlier. <laughs> Tell me you didn't jettison the one thing that can trace my parents? Actually, I did. <sighs> But first, I took down their latest coordinates. Incoming. That's... Thank you, Finn. See? He's not playing with us. Oh, yeah. Your brother mentioned you trust me. Maybe. 60% of the time. I can work with that. Thanks, Finn. Ooh! This is it, the last location of the EPIRB signal. 
Nothing on sonar. The hydrophone's not picking up anything here. There's nothing here. You still think Finn's 60% trustworthy? Well, I'm... I don't... <sighs> He's very smooth. I'll give him that. Almost had me fooled, too. Almost. <sighs> Can anyone hear me? Anyone out there? Gramps? Dad? Dad, can you hear me? 